first new hero in the newest progression system update her new legacy a knob here in this video and we're going to the patch notes of the game king god castle 5.7.1 you guys know the drill new hero it's around that time man like i feel like jinju the last newest hero just got super overshadowed by literally everything that happened unfortunate i her design was it, it is a little basic but she did have some interesting things going on but but lena like look at this artwork and just based on the art and the appearance you know what i'm saying the appearance she's gonna be a fan favorite it, like which um awesome piece you are going you are going to places you've never you've never gone before and i'll just leave it at that and it is a good now my only gripe about this right here is the the proportions now it, the proportions of the book okay boys the book proportions the this book is massive boys like why is the book so massive i have no freaking clue um south region mystique class she's a mystique class man like another support here like i mean clearly like th th this tells i mean obviously there's lore you guys can read that yourselves but apparently she has lore with mara so clearly maybe mara and uh, belina supposed to be design wise supposed to go together <laughs> but we all know what happens when uh you know there's the dev there's the dev team design you know um intention and then it is there is what the users will actually use it for right that that's just common so south region mystique class i wish they will share the love with mystique because her legacy she has a unique legacy and it's tied to Mystique class. So Mystique class, like they've just been hammering Mystique class for some freaking reason. But Belina is a support type hero who continuously assists allies and attacks enemies. So this this part right here, this design philosophy, like intention, um, not going to be the craziest popular. The, the, the character will be popular, but because just function wise their intention is like sub, quote unquote support hero now she does damage don't get me wrong i did try her a little bit we are going to be running into a chapter run build you know and just kind of testing her out and trying it and showing you guys what is up as usual you guys know the drill that you guys been trying to follow my channel so i of control her ability so she has these like eyeballs right and now forgive me if i'm wrong but she she starts with an eyeball all right she starts with an eye all right she she so she like has it pre-cooked all right boys and when she uses her ability she will share her, her a spirit you know eye looking thing right and attach that's that little eye blue eyeball thing that you see and when if you have this thing on you you will generate protection which is pretty nice right and if belina starts with uh, an eye she continuously just does protection at the very beginning right so instant survivability caked into the kit i love it um and when the damage so you're like oh where's the damage part right well when you do the ability right the the eyes essentially like emit damage right and that's kind of like her her thing so like it's not like canax stacking and things you know everyone loves dps characters you know we are we as king god castle players we just love big numbers high damage i mean that's with any game right so you know i like support utility you support utility doesn't does it just doesn't get as much um it's not eye candy you know like so i get it but like these things are really good for strategy and team building and things like that so it is very interesting and i welcome any and all of these uh interactions as possible you know every now and then dps is fine at danny but it, it, it you know it's gonna be popular now awesome please please for it's please how many times do i have to ask please include the potential abilities of the heroes in your patch notes please please um awaken ability um so her awaken ability is okay i mean it's it's essentially um rai awakening one right i mean yeah like the, the range is bigger and whatnot but i mean in 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 essence in essence it's like similar right so like rai awakening one basically whoever has the eyeball will explode when they're killed cool right um there is an important factor here it does it say it here yes it does there's an so 
Belina affixes third eye. This is uh, her eye thing, right? To two heroes besides besides boys. Okay, but unless this is unless it's a translation error, I mean it, this this wouldn't be the first time. Besides herself and summon creatures. Um, and I have tried her out and I have tested this and it is indeed true. At least in my testing, we'll see, we'll go into a chapter and we can see for ourselves, but she cannot share this. She can't self stack this, right? And you can only pretty much have one eye on yourself at the same time. I imagine her second awakening might might change that. I, I mean, that's an easy uh, ability to, to have, right? So, but right now, even at tier seven, the scalable of how many eyes you can have on a target is one, including herself. And she can't, she can't share, she can't stack eyes on herself. It's, it's not Kanak stacking, right? So besides herself and summon creatures, so this won't apply to Rydaws, this won't apply to Elizabeth Golems, what have you, right? It does not apply to any summoned creatures. There it is, there it is. Um, in case you guys were confused about that, because clearly, clearly there is something with Belina and Mara, for example, with Mara clone, and then um, we're gonna try that out actually uh, in a second, um, but we're gonna be trying out Belina and Mara, and uh, I kind of have like an interesting interesting setup, and we're gonna try it. It's probably gonna suck, but it's gonna be fun. <laughs> um, so her awakening ability is basically uh, awakening one Rai, you know, explode, cool, and then this is the Bloodstain legacy for a Ophelia it is heading to the normal pool now um, so you can get that so in place of that the new stuff is um, Belina's new legacy which is I think it's kind of OP I, I, I truly I truly think it's got it's more of like an arena one but it's just effect wise is OP um, I may or may not have a max one already don't worry about that um, basically it gives you crit damage uh, crit chance and it gives you for the max effects and things like that it gives you cc immunity and essentially um whatchamacallit it, the the thing that you uh cc resistance i don't know i forget i'm forgetting the term boys i'm forgetting the term so um this thing this was pretty freaking annoying now belina's limit is this limit is skin is pretty freaking good boys void witch belina look at that skin can i get a key art of that that is pretty sick if I, I love the color it's so different i just i hate it when they do like a limited skin and it's like a slightly different green like the the original model is green and then the limited skin is like a slightly different green and i hate it i love this color palette switch similar to like sarah's where like sarah's looks actually different right um i love that uh, i like pharrell i'm not really a big fan of the pharrell one i mean yeah it's cool but like he looks too similar i feel like the limited skin should be like really really different right and this one's good this is a limited skin by the way so this is only available for the release window of um, the new hero, right? So if you want it, you better get it now. You can't get it with gems. You gotta pay money for these. Um, but I do have the skin playlist on my channel. I do have all the skins. This will be posted as well. And here's the effect. Very cool. Interesting, interesting. I like it. Uh, Blue Wave Tabak. This is the festival skin. Tabak, you know, oh, the water effect. Hold on, let me look at this. Cool effect. Cool, cool 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 um this thing i don't recommend it bug fix is cool um now that now the the most important part of this is that now you can transcend legacy star level multiple times at once thank you this was so annoying man all right let's go in the game and do like a regular quick chapter run with belina all right belina's potential ability please awesome peace include this in your passions level four uh she gets an eye when an ally who has an eye dies now this doesn't really make sense to me because she already starts with an eye and you can't she can only have one eye uh stacked right if, if, to my knowledge you can only have one eye stack it's not like canak stacking um and my assumption the easiest assumption to make is that her second awakening ability allows her to stack eyes I, that that just makes sense to me um unless she she is able to stack eyes and i and i'm just dumb right uh, and that, that could very much be it uh, level eight is going to be a, a shortening of the interval of when the protection kicks in with, from her ability which is good i'm running like a sharpness crit uh set and then this is her um legacy level 30 don't worry about that uh but you can see that she removes crowd control when she does a, 
a, a beneficial effect, which uh, in her case is protection, and then grants CC immunity to the ally for one. So it's kind of like um, uh, Mersel's uh, second awakening ability kind of right um so that is pretty nice that i mean in a legacy is pretty nice this is her uh awaken ability which is like a rise awakening one this is her ability herself and up to you see right here up to one eye can exist at the same time that doesn't scale with tears boys at least in my like it, i don't know man maybe i'm missing something but i'm i'm, I'm assuming it's second awakening um you know prep for that so i have this weird team um don't worry about it we're gonna run into something i'm gonna be we're gonna be running mara because you know because of lore mara and belina has lore and i have mara attached with mystical armor which is going to be interesting because you know belina gives protection and then this thing will give mara uh, 300 defense when she gets protection and then she gets more protection gain and more spell power and and things like that so you know it is a wonky uh, interaction it's gonna be fun um and we're just gonna be running uh we're just gonna be running this um and i'm we're not gonna do anything free freaking crazy i don't have freaking enough food for corruption boys um you know what hold on do i have a ticket do i oh i do have a ticket okay we're gonna use a ticket boys um i am almost 90 percent sure that she's not able to do this um so i'm gonna i'm gonna do this we're gonna do wait hold, how many times can i up this holy uh i'm just gonna do wait how many ticks I'm gonna do this, all right, boys. I'm gonna do this. We're just gonna do 20 food run. I we're running hero blood, and we're gonna have fun, all right. Um, and we're gonna try it out. Hopefully, I don't die. Hopefully, I don't die. Um, it is not phase 15, to be fair, but I really don't think. Um, you know, she could probably do it. I'll be honest, she could probably do it, but we're doing some fun stuff <laughs> because if I actually want to do it um it's not gonna be too much fun right it's not gonna be too much fun so but we're gonna have fun i'm all about the fun so you see that there's the stack you know what this is not half bad So you can see that her clone doesn't get the eyeball, right? So it does not apply to um, summon units because her eyeball thing or the clone doesn't count as a, uh, it does it does count as a summon unit, right? So, and Belina herself starts with an eyeball. So I'm not sure, I'm not sure interesting uh oh okay we're good we're good <laughs> we're good we're good captain um we don't want that uh, i'll take the book um yes uh sure do i econ sure sure why not i need more maras as long as i don't get bursted down i'm fine yeah so you can see that she she starts with an eyeball so that means she's getting the um she's getting the protection like from the get-go right um i really need uh um what am i looking for <laughs> double up Double up. You know? Damage not bad. Damage not bad. Um. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, boom. We're gonna see because her providing protection is a beneficial effect. So I have her her legacy equipped right now, which is maxed, right? She should be getting CC immunity. Should be, right? Am I, unless I'm understanding that wrong? So 
so we're gonna see when the pool got these guys all right we're, we're gonna say this is the ultimate test boys oh i got lucky this is the ultimate test um mm, well i'm gonna say no because the protection doesn't uh da, 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 da. every 0 0.8 seconds so I, I i don't think it ticks first and then 0 0.8 seconds i think it waits 0 0.8 seconds first then ticks for the first time i'm gonna assume that's the interaction um so i'm gonna get pulled 100 percent yeah <laughs> confirmed and i died and i freaking died okay so we got it we got it we got to test it out boys we have to test it out okay so that does not work confirmed Confirm, boys. Freaking confirmed. Um, I need another Mara. We need we need more Maras. Uh, this is four units, right? Um, uh, do I? Uh, oh, that's not good. This is not good. Um, hold on. Okay. This is okay. Am I gonna die? I'm gonna die, aren't I? I'm gonna get pulled. I'm gonna get pulled. I'm gonna get pulled. The freak is this you guy? Alright, for science. Alright, boys, don't do what I did totally on purpose. I like I found out, so you guys didn't have to anyways let me know in the comments below what do you think about the newest hero belina do you like her design like support her i know everyone's frothing from the mouth for another dps heroes always dps heroes what do you think about the new legacy system there's a lot of big feelings i'm excited for in the future we should be getting a new chapter soon by the way i uh, like you know it's, it's freaking crazy to think about where we're going right um i'm freaking excited I just want the 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 patches and things like that and the updates that they've been in the process of fixing to just just to go ahead and make it go out and be live so they can focus on like the new stuff, right? So the two main things, Stripe Battlefield optimization, they've been working on this forever, please. And then second one, just do your Tower Trials revamp and then touch your Great Rift and then <laughs> i mean i mean you guys can do something about raid if you want to i don't really, I personally don't really care um but um and then you know all this other stuff just get those big ticket items that we've known about so long like i just want them to address those first and then they can focus on like the new stuff like i'm pretty happy right now with the content that is out there i just want the rest of the new chapters and all of that and i just i just can't wait i just can't wait and at least we can say that we have a future to look forward to um because in the past there there wasn't that like looking forward to future it's kind of like oh uh this is what we have and we, we we take it right there was no looking forward to the future of the next thing like oh like you know the dark ages of when is chapter 10 right or you know those those of you who started when chapter 10 existed you you played for like a week and you're like when's chapter 11 right so those were different times boys those were different times anyways i'm talking too much and as a quick reminder i do have all the skins in my skinless playlist with all the sound effects and all of that and all the skins i do have them all no bgm and i will have my general hero tier list updated very soon with the uh, jinju and belina added and the progression update kind of you know threw a wrench in my content schedule but that is coming out very soon and as always thumbs if you like this subs if you loved it and i'll see you next one boys later